Hey guys, I'm Reed, that's Eric, and this is Samsung Business Television. Hey man, thank you so much for coming to the studio today. I really appreciate it. Eric Carey hanging out with us today talking about how to use Samsung Smart Switch, transferring information from an iOS device to include an iPhone, an iPad, an iPod Touch to a Samsung Galaxy Note 8. Pretty amazing stuff and it's pretty simple to use. But the question is, how easy is it to use? Very easy, actually. Whether your old device is an Android, iOS, Blackberry, or Windows mobile device, upgrading to a Galaxy smartphone is easy in one seamless switch with Smart Switch. All right, so that's great to hear. Uh, I understand there's two ways to do this. There's either wired or wireless. Uh, but before we go into wireless, let's go through the wired steps first. Sound good? First, make sure that the batteries for both devices are fully charged and that the USB cable is connected. Okay. Second, make sure you deregister iMessage. Okay. And before we get started, make sure you turn off two-factor authentication or two-step verification for your Apple ID account. Okay. All right, with that being said, let's get to step one. The wired steps to set up Smart Switch include step one, selecting Smart Switch. Step two, select USB. You'll need a dongle to connect the two devices together. Step three, connect your connector to the device. Then you should see transfer from device on your iPhone and connecting to iOS device on your Note 8. Lastly, you should see a pop-up message appear on your iOS device. Step four, tap trust. Step five, tap next. You'll see a pop-up showing connecting to iOS device on your screen. Step six, select items to transfer. Smart Switch will recommend a group of applications that you can download based on the applications on your iOS device. You can choose to download them all at once or come back to them later. And lastly, step seven, hit send and then you're done. You'll see a list of apps that you can download at your leisure. Something to think about though is they'll need to be downloaded individually. Okay. So pretty, pretty simple indeed. Uh, let's go through the steps on how to transfer wirelessly. For the wireless transfer, there's a few steps we'll need to do first. First, ensure that you have a device backup to iCloud. Second, make sure to deregister iMessage. Third, you'll need to turn off two-step verification or two-factor authentication for your Apple ID account. Step one, select Smart Switch. Step two, select Wireless. Step three, select your old phone. Step four, sign into iCloud. Step five, import from iCloud. The phone will then prepare and import the data from iCloud. The data is transferred. Great, can we switch via computer as well? Absolutely. You'll need to download the Smart Switch application to your Mac or PC, mm -hmm. and you'll follow a similar set of steps after that. You'll need to make a backup of your data from your old phone to your computer, so that way data can be transferred. That's it, it's done. Eric, thank you so much for coming to the studio today. Eric Carey hanging out with us talking about how to use Samsung Smart Switch to switch from an iOS device to a Samsung Galaxy Note 8. Hope you guys learned something. I know I did. Check us out next time. And as always, we will see you on the internet. Second. There's a second thing. Yeah. Great. Can we switch via computer as well? See what I did there? <laughs>